What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Gerald from Bank of Gerald here with another video update. Today is Friday, October the 20th, 2023. Today, we're going to be talking about a platform that uh, we all know or should know by this point, or you guys should know my opinion, I'll say. Uh, but this platform is probably gone. All right? It's been gone. But what they have been doing is they've been keeping people updated in their Telegram group. And um, just like we kind of been talking about, just like we kind of predicted, they have again moved the goalpost and they've moved it like way out. <laughs> so we're going to talk about it. Uh, feel free to share your thoughts and comments, whatever, in the comment section. Uh, most of us have already known Vortex is probably on its way out. And when companies do like this, we're not we're not naive at this point. We we know um, that when companies do this, that they don't really have a plan of coming back. We have not seen any company um, really do it like this. And we're I want to keep in mind that today is October the 20th, 2023. All right, before I get started, I want to remind all of you that I am not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice, and I am not your financial advisor. I am just a dude on YouTube showing you guys how I am cranking out that crypto in many different platforms, nothing more and nothing less than that. Now, if you like this content, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. If you want to be updated and notified about everything going on here at BOJ, just make sure you hit the notification bell as well. And please, sir, please, ma'am, don't get scammed by the WhatsApp man, because if he gets you, there's nothing I can do to help you. Stay diligent and vigilant in this space and in the comment section as well. We're going to go straight to the Telegram group, and I'm actually surprised at the reactions that I'm seeing under this post. Um, they seem to all be positive ones, and I'm not sure if they're real or um, generated by some kind of bot because Telegram has a lot of different capabilities and different sideways things that um, you're able to do and add and all this different stuff. So anyway, um, we're not saying that that's what's going on, but what I, what I am saying is that I am surprised, right? Um, so here, just at the reaction, but not at the not at the announcement. So let's go ahead and get to the announcement. Um, we saw the latest before this one was on the 11th of October, just last week, and they were talking about um, how they were going to bring an exchange and um, they're going to be making sure that everybody's made whole and you know for the switch and they'll give an announcement on what it's going to take and all that different stuff, right? So um, here they go. They're talking about what they plan to do in their next steps. Let's go ahead and talk about it. Um, Dear Vortic United Partners, we have prepared the roadmap for you and planned the next steps. First, Sunday, this coming Sunday, all right? So they're giving you something that's that's close. Uh, the rebranding will start and we will present the new logo and branding, all right? On Wednesday, the maintenance on the database will start addressing the accounting issue. All right, so I'm not exactly sure what, that means when they talk about addressing the accounting issue. Um, now, when I go to the previous note, it says all all clients will get their current account balance plus their current active package value, 100%, if not just 80% uh, added to their exchange account. So maybe they're going to be going over everybody's account on Wednesday um, and starting the database migration or uh, addressing the accounting issue. It doesn't mean that we're going to be getting a withdrawal to my um in my opinion, doesn't mean we're going to be able to get a withdrawal. Um, but anyway, let's keep going. Um, the soft demo launch of the exchange is set for the 15th of April. So the 15th of April, we are, let's just round down. We're at, let's just say we're at the 15th of October, right? Just to make it simple for my head, right? We got October, November, December, January, February, March and April. Six months. Six months that they want you to wait until the soft slash demo launch of the exchange is set for April 15th. Now, of course, if you have plans on being on this earth, which I hope we all do, then that day will come, God willing, and who knows what we'll see from Vortic or whatever they rebrand themselves into. Who knows? But let's be honest. We don't, we don't know any platforms that we've been a part of that have taken that type of um, like taking that type of time to come back, all right, with funds that we can use. Anyway, let's keep going. First of June, the exchange will be switched to live mode and you will have funds, all funds available in your balance. So they're pretty much telling you all your funds will be available in your balance of this new exchange by June of next year. November, December, January, February, March. April. Let me do that again. <laughs> I want to make sure that I'm doing this. January, uh, uh, um, November, December, January, February, March, 
April, May, June. That's a lot of months to be waiting. All right, that's that's all I'm saying. Oh, they gave me a little animation here. Anyway, I hope y'all can still hear me. Um, let's keep reading. As you know, we had several bad trades, which caused a huge drawdown in the period till uh in the period till the official relaunch. We will continue with our made trading strategy to recover all losses. Once the exchange is live, you'll be able to either withdraw the funds or continue using our trading strategies in form of copy trading. The event will be held a month after the go live of the exchange, which would then be July of next year. The exact dates will be announced once the demo is live. Regular updates will be posted here in the news channel. Stay tuned. And people are giving thumbs up and hearts and fire emojis. I ain't, that ain't that ain't fire. There's nothing fire about that. Um, I'm trying to figure out what exactly happened with my, I guess, I guess my Zoom tried to do something too fancy. Anyway, just wanted to bring that notification, that note um, to you guys. Let me see if I can stop the video and bring it back. There we go. I just wanted to bring that note to you guys because um, in my personal opinion, this is just Vortic letting everybody know in a, in a not letting everybody know type of way that they're not coming back. They expect me to wait this long for them. No, I'm not going to sit on my hands and, and wait for Vortic. Uh, we did a lot of good work in Vortic. Uh, Vortic turned out to be just another one of those um, platforms that would do that were willing to do the most, right? Have real or real people involved and and, and hold you know office opening parties and fly people out to Istanbul. It's one of those companies that obviously had a lot of support because they were able to afford doing all this until they weren't. All right, until they weren't able to pay us anymore. Until they start losing trades, whatever the case may be. Uh, we all know that they all have, all platforms have their story of why they come and why they go. All right, um, all, most of them have a roadmap, what they want to do, and all this different stuff, and they'll say it. And that's just the, the fact of the matter is they're saying it to keep you in there long enough to do what lasts however long they're gonna last and say they're gonna not pay anymore, and it's not paying. Um, that is the space. That is the risk of this space. All right. This is something that we learn along the journey and we decide whether this is something we want to play in or not. Um, of course, I'm still here, but we have to, you know, we have to, you know, learn from moments like this, like we have in the past. And it doesn't keep us from joining them. It doesn't keep me from joining. them. All right. Um, what it does, it just teaches me how to better manage my risk. All right. And if there's something that I want outside of what I'm able to um, put in as, I, as my own risk capital, you have to go and attack it in a, in a different way. Um, but at the same time, um, this is a platform that uh, did the most to prove its validity in the space. And um, right now they're still doing the most, um, you know, but they could just end all communication. They could. And if, and if some chance by some chance, they are actually doing what they say they're going to, then we'll see in, in due time, <laughs> in due time, we'll find out. Um, but I'm not holding out on hope. You know, this is why we continue to diversify. This is why we continue to bring new platforms. This is why we continue to, um, you know, try to spread things out. Uh, at this point, you almost rather have a hundred dollars in ten things than a thousand dollars in one. Um, and that's just a figurative, you know, way of thinking. Not telling you guys what to put in or anything like that. Um, but that's that's just the space, and this is the space that we're playing. And so, at the end of the day. Uh, we have to handle ourselves accordingly. This is just another lesson. Um, you know, platforms will try to string you out like this. And if you allow them in your mind to string you out like this, then you can end up strung out. And uh, I, ain't, I ain't into that strung out. <laughs> I ain't into being strung out. Anyway, um, Vortex United, yeah, it is what it is. Um, I've been removed the link, so hopefully nobody's adding new money. Hopefully they're not even taking new money. Uh, and we'll probably see their website either change to whatever they rebrand or just completely shut down. Um, anyway. Put your 2FA on all the platforms that will allow you and all your wallets. Crypto is indeed the wild, wild west, y'all. If you ain't strapped, you're bound to get hacked. Ask me how I know. It's not very fun at all. If you like this content, hit subscribe. If you want to be updated, hit the bell. Uh, and uh, please, sir, please, ma'am, don't get scammed by the WhatsApp man in the comment section or anywhere, Telegram, WhatsApp, any of those places, because crypto, oh, uh, we'll, we'll just say it like this. Uh, if, if they get you, there's nothing I can do to help you, right? So don't give them anything, okay? Peace out. I'll see y'all in the next one.